Hey everybody, Substatica here. I'm pleased to announce the availability of my latest mod, Playable Instruments, for The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners Chapter 2 Retribution. As we're getting started here, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 50,000 subscribers, I'd love to have you on the team. Also like, share, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the video, of this mod, or of any mods you'd like to see for Retribution, or any other games for that matter. And if you'd like to support the channel, there's ways that you can do that in the description. Modding ain't easy, and in this case I had to purchase some royalty-free music that can be played on the instruments in the game. Now, devs and studios don't always get to implement what they'd like for games, and I'm sure that Skydance would have wanted these instruments to be playable if they had the time or the budget, whatever the reason. So I've gone ahead and implemented that. There will be a link in the description to where you can download this mod. And we are here at Hotel Eclair to grab some instruments from this hotel room, which is a bottle. I don't want that, I want my flashlight which is one of the easiest places to get all three instruments, the guitar, the trumpet, and the saxophone. We are just gonna put them in our pack for now. And we'll just hold on to the sax for a second. So the way that you play instruments with this mod depends on the instrument. For instance, the saxophone, you need to put the mouthpiece to your mouth and then pull the trigger on the controller holding the saxophone. Now since music soothes the savage beast, walkers won't attack you and can't damage you if you're playing an instrument. So we can stroll around New Orleans playing sweet, sweet music. Now, if we move the instrument too far from our mouth, it's gonna stop playing. If we kept the trigger held down, we can just move it back to our mouth and it'll resume the same song. If we release the trigger and hold it away for more than five seconds, it will restart that song. All of the songs loop, and there are three songs for each instrument. And to randomize the song that it's playing, put the instrument in your backpack, take it out again, and play again. Oh yeah. Now, there is a way for you to add custom music, but that's going to take some knowledge of Unreal. And if you're interested in doing that, join either my Discord or the Whisperers Modding Group Discord for more info on it. Now, the trumpet is like the saxophone in that you need to have the mouthpiece up to your mouth and then pull the trigger or press the button on the controller holding the instrument. And as a side note, I also fixed the grip on the trumpet. Sweet, sweet music. 
what would New Orleans be without music? Now, for the guitar, you need to pull the trigger on the hand holding the guitar, and you need to have your other hand in close proximity to the strings. How's it going? <sighs> See what other songs we have on the guitar. Oh, well, same one. It's random, so you can get the same one over and over. That's how it goes. There we go. Something a little more bluesy. Now, all of the instruments in the game will be replaced with playable versions in this mod, except for Slim Dog's guitar, because that's a quest item. It was a little trickier, so I just avoided the issue. Well, there you go. Just in time for Christmas, playable instruments for The Walking Dead, Saints and Sinners, Chapter 2, Retribution. Thanks for watching. Happy holidays.